Right now, Elizabeth Warren continues to take selfies with supporters more than an hour after this rally ended up on stage. She often referred to Houston, Houston as the city that gave her the chance to live her dream job. The question tonight, will the debate in Houston help propel her to the presidency? My first big job was back in Houston, and I was so excited. From the moment Elizabeth Yay. Warren took to the stage, she pushed policy proposals by Got telling her life story, including the time school, spent studying and teaching at the University of Houston. Back then, that cost $50 a semester. University of Houston, go Cougs. Hundreds turned out to hear the Massachusetts senator In just days country. before ABC's Democratic debate at Texas Southern GMP. University. This is when I learned words. Many wonder, is Warren the one to take on President Trump? It's a hard thing that we're going to have to decide, like whether we want to vote for a candidate that stands up for the values that we have or whether it's a candidate that we just think could be President Trump. So um, I'm hopeful that she could. I'd really like to see the field start to narrow down uh, because there's been a lot of candidates. With respect to... After the campaign speech and questions, to Warren told us system. she's ready is, for Thursday night. How do you set yourself apart on that debate stage come Thursday night in Houston? For me, this is just about a chance to talk about why I'm in this fight and how I'm fighting it. Um, I got a chance to talk to people in Houston, a chance to talk to people in Texas, a chance to talk to people all over America. That's what I've been doing from the beginning. We asked her, should the energy capital of the world worry about a Warren administration? Senator, you have ties to Houston. The debate I do. obviously is going to be in Houston. What do you say to the people of Houston about supporting your campaign when they may see some of your policies and say they're not energy friendly? Yeah, I see this as they're friendly for the people who live in Houston, they're friendly for the people who live on this earth. The urgency of the problems created by climate change cannot be ignored any longer. Warren plans to spend the night in the Texas Capitol. She'll head to Houston tomorrow as she gets ready to take center stage right here on ABC 13.